Merry Christmas to all of you awesome people who are celebrating out there. My name is Robin Wong. I'm a photographer based in Kompor, Malaysia. This is my last video for the year 2023 and I want to share about the reasons why I still love my Thirds system today. Let's do this! I have been shooting with Micro Four Thirds system for more than 10 years now. The Micro Four Thirds has always been my main workhorse for my professional shoots and I've also been using Micro Four Thirds system for my personal projects. I find that the cameras and lenses, they deliver fantastic results, they perform really well, it gets the job done, my clients are happy, I'm very happy with the results. So far, they have not let me down. I've had a few opportunities to jump shoot or switch systems, especially after I've left the Olympus Ambassador program about almost two years ago. A lot of people are asking, hey Robin, come to the Fuji site. Hey Robin, look at the Sony. Sony full frame is like the next best thing. Hey Robin, why don't you go medium format? There are a lot of options out there and we are not lack of really good camera options, especially today in the year 2023, we're moving to 2024, but I'm still staying loyal to Micro Four Thirds and I want to share my reasons why in this video. Also, I want to compile a list of my favorite photographs that I've taken with my Micro Four Thirds cameras. Of course, I cannot share the photographs I've taken from my jobs. The clients, all of them are private, but these are the shots that I've taken from my shutter therapy sessions. Reason number one why I love Micro Four Thirds system so much is their lenses. They are really small, really compact, they are so light, they truly embody what Micro Four Thirds stand for. There's nothing quite like them, not as compact from other camera manufacturers. And these lenses, they are already so sharp, they perform so well, even shooting at wide open apertures. I'll just take a look at this Olympus 75 f1.8 for example. For such a small lens, it has the reach of 150 millimeters in equivalent in 35 millimeters format. This is telephoto lens in such a compact form factor and yet it has bright aperture f1.8. At this size, at this image quality that the lens delivers, at this bright aperture f1.8, what this lens can do, you cannot find an equivalent lens from any other manufacturers and this was the lens that prevented me from switching over to full frame. I've talked about this before, I'll share the video up here. Please check it out if you have not done so. Similarly with any other Panasonic and Olympus Micro Four Thirds lenses, they are so small, they perform so well. Once you have used them, you understand why I love Micro Four Thirds so much. Reason number two, reliability. I've been shooting with Micro Four Thirds cameras and lenses for the past 10 years. The first camera was the Olympus EM1 Original. Subsequently, I upgraded to the EM1 Mark II. I still use the EM1 Mark II today. It's my main professional photography workhorse. These cameras, they have never failed me. They've always delivered fantastic shots. My clients are happy. And every time I use these cameras, there's that confidence that I'll nail the job, it'll get the job done. And it's that confidence that I really treasure when I use Micro Four Thirds system. I can't say the same for other camera systems.
Reason number three, superior handling. Not only are these Micro Four Thirds cameras and lenses being really small and really light, but the handling on these cameras are second to none. And it's part of the balance between the camera and lens. They are both truly small. I know some full frame cameras, they are really small, but their lenses are like gigantic, right? Especially the high grade ones. But the Micro Four Thirds system, although the lenses are so small, but they are already so fantastic. They're super sharp and they get really professional great quality and because the lenses are so small they're balanced really well with the camera bodies and if you've used any of these micro four thirds high grade cameras say the Olympus OMD cameras the EM1, EM1 Mark II they have the best handling and ergonomics of any cameras out there I am not kidding now I'm not getting any younger so I really appreciate the camera system to be smaller and lighter I appreciate the superior handling because I'm shooting longer duration of time for my professional shoots sometimes I'm shooting the entire day holding the camera so being more comfortable being easier to handle being lighter it enables me to move quicker, it enables me not to strain so much carrying these cameras and lenses around. I don't hurt myself, I don't break my back using this Micro Four Thirds system. And to me, that's truly important. Reason number four, sufficiency. I know a lot of people want to achieve technical perfection. The more, the better. They want more megapixels, better dynamic range, and clean high ISO shooting. But for me, Micro Four Thirds system has always been sufficient. Since the EM1 Mark II, I'm still very happy with the images I get from that 20 megapixels image sensor. I have enough resolution for my professional shoots. I can't say the same for you. I understand certain photography will require higher resolution then that may not be sufficient. I understand, but for what I do, it's more than sufficient. I've never encountered a situation where the dynamic range was beyond what I can recover from the extreme highlights and shadows. I always manage to balance my shots, even in extremely harsh conditions. And I've been doing some really low light shooting as well in extreme conditions where I have to shoot with ISO 6400, 2800. I've talked about this before. I'll put the link to the video up here. Please check it out, how I dealt with high ISO shooting with OM1 or EM1. Mark II and these Micro Four Thirds cameras, they are more than sufficient to get fantastic results that I've delivered to my clients and I personally am very happy with the images. I've never wished that they got any better. So yeah, we can wish for more and more and better and better technical aspects of the camera but at, one, at what point are you going to stop and really appreciate what you have and start making awesome images? And finally, reason number five, and perhaps the most important reason, is that I truly enjoy shooting with Micro Four Thirds system. For the past two years, I've been actively exploring other options. I've been trying the Fuji ST4, ST5, X-Pro2, X-Pro3, and even the SH2 series cameras. I've tried the Sony A7C, I've tried the Sony A7 Mark IV, or A7R series cameras. I've also tried the Canon R5, R5, R6, I've also ventured into Nikon, uh, the Z6 Mark II or even the Z7. I've tried all these cameras more and more and a lot of people question, hey Robin, you know, if you have tried these other cameras, if you've tried what Sony can do, you'll never go back to Micro Four Thirds. Hey Robin, if you've only seen how amazing this Fuji system is, you will never go back to Micro Four Thirds. Hey, I am a photographer. I will always be curious about what everyone else is doing and I will always find opportunities to try any other camera system whenever I can get my hands on them. And you know what? After all this trial and error and experimentations, I still come back to Micro Four Thirds because these Micro Four Thirds cameras are the ones that I enjoy shooting the most. 
I personally think that I'm one of the largest, if not the largest, Marco Fothers supporter there is. And that's not going to change. I'm going to continue to use my Marco Fothers cameras and lenses. I love them so much. And you know what? Yes, I've said that I'm happy with whatever the Marco Fothers cameras can give me now, but I also want to continue to see progress in Marco Fothers system. So my wish for the coming the year 2024 is for OM Digital Solutions and Panasonic to both continue to push the boundaries of imaging and to really bring innovation to Micro Four Thirds system and give us truly wow products that we can be really happy with. Everyone else is getting better and Micro Four Thirds deserves the same. That's all to share about why I love Micro Four Thirds system. Do you agree with my sharing? Do you still use Micro Four Thirds? Let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear your thoughts. If you've enjoyed looking at my photographs and if you have found my sharing beneficial, please consider buying me a cup of coffee or you can contribute directly to my PayPal. Links in the description below on how I can do that. Any small contribution goes a long way. It will definitely help me to continue making more content. As the last video of the year, I will leave you with a video preview of my photo book, the last photo book that I've printed for this year. I've made three, and this is the final one. It's a compilation of some of my favorite photographs. And guys, if you really take photography seriously, you should definitely print your photographs. I hope you have had a wonderful seasonal holiday celebration and I hope that 2023 has been kind to you and I'll see you early next year. Bye-bye.